Yeah. Mr. Lainas. Um, separation of power is an essential pillar of the rule of law. Judges should not make policy and politicians should not take the seat of judges. And it's therefore extremely concerning to see that in Spain this concept is completely turned around. Prime Minister Sanchez no longer protects the separation of power. Instead, he embraces the power of separation. A slippery politician who will do anything to cling on to power and who cares more about his own position than about the unity of his country or the opinion of his citizens. It's exactly the type of behavior that has no place in a democratic system, that has no place in Europe. And it only serves the interests of those opposing democracy in the first place. Let's not forget Putin was willing to spend billions in support of the Catalan independence movement in order to undermine the stability of Spain and through Spain the stability of Europe. He can now sit back and relax because the Spanish socialists are doing his job for him and free of charge. Not so long ago, Prime Minister Sanchez vowed he would never support amnesty. He justified spying on Catalans because of the graveness of their crimes. Here in this house, not so long ago, with the full support of the SND group, we criticized Russia's deep interference with the Catalan movement and demanded a real investigation. Today, you defend an amnesty for all those involved. If this was about any other European country, you would have been screaming for the European Commission to intervene, and rightfully so. Today, you are telling Commissioner Reinders to mind his own business. It is pure hypocrisy. Spain deserves better. Europe deserves better. Oh, yes. um, that's, uh, Isabella Helena Klotz. Thank you, Ms. Klotz, for one minute.